I am Dr. Anand Raman, Consultant Endocrinologist at Magna Centers for Obesity, Diabetes and Endocrinology at BTM Layout, Bangalore. Insulin pump is a small pocket sized device. So it is uh, of a size which you can slip into an average pocket which can store insulin in a small cartridge and uh, through the cartridge inject insulin into the skin uh, continuously. This is called an insulin pump. It is uh, in for patients with type 1 diabetes and for select patients with type 2 diabetes it is superior to taking insulin through pen. So even if you are taking insulin through pen for it is ideally suited for those who are already taking uh, insulin via a pen, uh, taking it 3 to 4 times a day. So here you don't have to take it so many times, you can use an introducer and uh, connect uh, the insulin tubing uh, to the skin and uh, the insulin pump is attached to the tubing and uh, insulin is injected slowly. So why is it superior to giving insulin uh, subcutaneously using a insulin pump? So it's very interesting. So we have two types of insulin, basal insulin and bolus insulin or meal related insulin but uh, you know basal insulin is an insulin which is supposed to work throughout the day say for instance if you inject 10 units of insulin it's supposed to last till next day but uh, in the course of a day if a patient has hypoglycemia you cannot withdraw this particular insulin which is already injected it's in the bloodstream of the individual so the logical thing to do when a person has low sugar and has diabetes is to withdraw the insulin so when you are on an insulin pump this particular thing becomes possible. So the insulin is injected into the skin uh, multiple times throughout the hour. So in an hour, the insulin is injected several times, say maybe 15 to 20 times in the entire uh, hour actually. So whenever uh, there is a hypoglycemia, the first thing that we can do is stop the administration of the basal rate. Okay, And also you can program a variable basal rate for an insulin pump. So when you give a basal insulin, so the same level of insulin is attained in the blood throughout the 24 hours. But uh, with the insulin pump, you can give insulin at a rate of uh, say uh, 1 unit per hour for 8 hours, 0.1 unit per hour whenever the requirement of insulin is less, especially early mornings when the patient is sleeping. So this particular thing is advantageous in preventing low sugars in those who have no insulin at all in the body. So it helps us to precisely dose insulin in such patients. So it is definitely an advance over taking insulin in the skin using a pen device.